Hi and welcome back to my channel. This is the daily bib of one video every day. Today we will have a look inside this RCF speaker. It is here for a repair and I will try to find something and then I will discuss it with my customer. Here we see a large deformation. Looks like uh, the speaker crashed onto the ground somewhere. This must not be the main reason for the fault. It could be something completely different. And here we are. We have a large power transformer made by Noratel. Strange uh, rubber tubes on the filtering caps. Not a lot of through hole parts on this PCB. And I've seen some SMD parts uh, down below. This is the Alps potentiometer. Seems like this board is also used for different models. The PCB is gold plated. Yeah, it's a nice one. Here's the bottom side of the PCB with many, many SMD parts. A look at the power amp section. This one is really nice. Wow. Beautiful. Okay. This is not beautiful. <laughs> oh my goodness. Why? <laughs> Okay. <laughs> Here's another interesting board. Beautiful. And inside we have a uh, neodymium uh, driver for the low frequencies and another probably neodymium driver for the high frequencies. Ah yes, look at the type number. ND. Not a lot in here, but the speaker is very light in weight. And that's very convenient. And I think I have found the problem. Yeah, this amp got a lot of uh, stress. It probably has fallen down to the floor. And look at this potentiometer here. It's mechanically stuck. You can't turn it uh, more than like uh, 50 degrees and I'm sure this is broken yeah oh yeah look at the marks here wow the PCB is fine though yeah a new potentiometer and it should work again. That's it for today and see you again soon. Bye! 
Ah, yes, um, please support the Daily Bib. You can put the thumbs up, you can donate a dollar or two or ten dollars like Stephen White. And yeah, this helps a lot. Bye. Let's shake hands. <laughs> nah, really, you are all welcome. Thank you for watching. Bye. So, what do we expect to see?